Hi everyone, this is Teelan Peterson here, your class president for the class academic year of 2019-2020. Um, what I'd like to show you today is how to navigate the Rocky Vista main page. Um, Rocky Vista has what's called My Vista, and in order to get to it, we're going to start from the main rvu.edu here. So go ahead and take a second, put that into your browser. We'll get from here. This is um, basically where they're throwing a lot of uh, different tools. You'll be really familiar with this by the time you're done with your first year. But what we need to um, introduce you to and make you comfortable with first off is uh, where we go to navigate all of our course material. So how to do that is from this main page, we're going to come over and go to My Vista. That brings me to this page. You'll be given a six letter login ID. I'm going to go ahead and put in mine 1833. And my password. And that brings us to this main page, right? Now, with My Vista, um, the top tabs and these quick links are your best friends. Um, the first thing you'll want to really make sure that you have down is everything under the students and financial. The rest are special programs you won't really have to worry about until after your first semester. By that time, hopefully, you should be well acquainted with this. Um, however, we'll go into students. Um, this page gives you all the important dates as well as your academic calendar. Um, you should be able to find that when you first log in. It also has all the information that you'll need they'll request them specifically in email so you won't really have to worry about adding or dropping courses that's all done for you um, and as well you may not see all of these um, but the things you will see um, should be pretty self-explanatory where we want to go next is courses so if you'll go over to the quick links you'll have the first semester of courses you've been enrolled in we are going to start with the heart where everything should start um, so this is the uh, course landing page for the course cardiovascular systems one you will be seeing this uh, sometime around october um, but the excuse me november it looks like um, october november time frame the cardiovascular system they put everything all of your lectures um, anything you may need as well as a lot of times the um, any announcements that they have as well here um, first things first, you're going to want to know where your syllabus is. You can usually download that. Um, professors, most professors will make a tab on this side for you for syllabus. Then you have course materials. You'll go here. There's also an external site called Media Site. This is where we record and post the lectures. So you'll be able to view those real time or my favorite times three and a half. Um, that kind of helps you consume this. Uh, a lot quicker. Um, now for the meat of the course, they put these in different parts. For here, uh, it's broken up by day. So 1022, um, we had these lectures at these times. Um, they went over things like the introduction, so on and so forth. You'll find all the lectures you need. Um, usually beforehand, they're pretty good about posting things, but um, on a day-by-day -day basis, and then uh, they'll update them as needed. Um, you can't necessarily download uh, these as the teacher will present them because they want to sometimes mute the answers so that you'll come prepared having read the knowledge beforehand but there's all this information for just the first part and then this usually ends with a let's review everything before the exam so this is the last material before exam one and then for this particular course there was I believe two exams um, the first was this and then fit part two, which is the physiology in the farm. So um, everything in all your other courses should be handled about a similar uh, way. It is a little different from course to course, but we just wanted to make sure that you got the lowdown on how to get in here. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to ask a second year. We'll know how to do it. We've been working with it for a long time um, or anyone in student affairs because they're wonderful. Thank you and have a great day.